on the 3rd of May, then how in the name of God are you going to have the 2022 heat examination taking place in, in, on, on the 21st of May? Over 85% students have voted for the postponement in the five-hour poll, which was, which was organized. Students are arguing that they will not have enough time to prepare for this exam in such a short span of time, and therefore it should be postponed. This subject has gone across to various arm of judiciary as well, but it has not uh, it has not found any solution so far. Dr. Rohan Krishnan, actually president of the Final Doctors Association, joining us live. Dr. Krishnan, what is the and Anubhash Rasa there uh, uh, live with us as well? First to you, Dr. Rohan. Why why are the students of the view that a what a gap of roughly 18, 20 days is not good enough to prepare for the 2022 meeting? You're muted, you're muted, you're muted, Rohit. Just unmute it. Yeah, go ahead. No, you're still muted. I, I can't hear you. Oh, well, let me go across to Anubhaji Vasa. Anubhaji, Anubhaji, what, what explains Anubhaji? You know, we've looked at this question multiple occasions in the past. Postponed exams, postponed exams. We've gone through a cycle of lockdown, this COVID and whatnot. When you have a window for exams, why not go ahead and handle it? Thank you for having me here, Dr. Tenji Ji. As far as the postponement which we were planning in the, during pandemic, that was a different scene altogether. But here, for need PG aspirants, the counselling is not yet over. After this uh, all India counselling will get, get over, state counselling will start. And many state counselling, uh, uh, the exam is, uh, dates are clashing with state counselling. There are some states like today I got to know that Gujarat has also postponed the state counselling today. It was supposed to be held on Fourth of May or third, I remember. They have postponed it till seven. So uh, the exams are going to clash with the state courts, which is yet to be done. That's why these students are demanding that from where, whether we, we should be able to appear for exam, whether we should appear for exam or we should wait for the counselling. Until unless counselling happens, how will they get to know whether they have? Been but tell me, or not? give me the so counter that, argument. But otherwise, you give me the counter argument. What happens if you postpone the exam? Let's say you're saying that, okay, a gap of two weeks is not enough. You postpone the exam, what, by a month, two months? What happens then? Does it not impact the, the next cycle in 2023? It will. It will impact, no doubt. Kenji, it will impact. All the resident doctors protested last year. We have been protesting since past many months for the counselling to happen on time. The counselling was supposed to begin in the month of uh, August last year or September. But it got delayed because of the matter in Supreme Court and government already delayed in the court. Then the matter was uh, extended and was uh, postponed till I think January. And in January the counselling began. The counselling should have been conducted and should have been closed by the month of March. In two months the counselling was supposed to end but it could not happen. And now they have extended, they have postponed for the counselling till the month of May. So there is a delay from the government side, not from student side. Students are ready. The counselling would have happened in the month of March. In the, that, uh, within two months' time, from January till March, students would have appeared for the exam in the month of May. Okay, Rohan, uh, Rohan, Rohan is back with us. Let me get a quick question for Rohan. Rohan, if you postpone the exams now, 